It's Martin Hume there. He used to be the Australian coach. Oh, okay. Then he went to then he went to China. Oh wow. Rumour has it he might be paddling again in the Olympics. No way. <laughs> That's what I heard yesterday. Fifteenth time. C1 500 final. So this is again Martin Fuxer who, who ran yesterday. Delighted. Takini also did well. So again, it's a similar similar lineup as we had in the actual in the C1 1000. Glasnevau, Victor from Poland. The older Tarnowski. The younger the ones younger. not allowed to compete for a while. Thomas Imad, who was competing yesterday in France. A great start yesterday. For the Chinese. And you from China. Let's see what he can do. Two Chinese boats. So they're away. This is 500 race. Start. No surprise there. He's also one of those people that can do every distance. So who's that? Fuxer. Yes. Mm -hmm. Great style. Yeah. With his brothers coming through as well. He raced. Yeah. Uh, he said his, his dream would be to go to uh, take care with his younger brother. Yeah. Luckily they pedal on different sides, so they can easily see too. Yesterday we saw Fuxer come first, Tarnowski second, Takini third. Is it going to be the same thing? Lane number six, it's certainly Thomas Simar from France. He came eighth yesterday after a bit of a fast start. But I think Fuxo was fairly realistic. Any race where Brendel's in, you're normally behind him. Any race he's not, you have to mention him. <laughs> yeah. Then Isaiah Cruz de Santos, I believe, is going to be competing next week for us. So it's going to be all the all the big names, hopefully. Yeah. Their races are always my favourite to watch. Uh, Fuxer's Brendan always brings out a different race plan. He always wins, though. <laughs> yes. Fuxer, the, the last few metres are incredibly exciting, but we do have a good two-horse race at the moment. Fuxer against Tarnowski is coming through. We had a second yesterday, so obviously had a... Or well, his secret is, had a good winter training. Coming up to the line with about 100 metres to go. Looks like Fuxer's got the lead. He has at the moment. He has about a meter and a half, two meters. Really, I could say he's controlled the race there. Yeah. Martin Fuxer takes it for Czech Republic, and it looks like Thomas Simar oh, held on this time. That, that stung, I think. <laughs> Very different techniques and styles in this race, but all seem to be very effective. In canoe, they can afford to paddle so differently. Whereas I suppose that you say in kayaks more, you have, there's one style that works. Uh, there's, there's more than one style, but there's normally like a core kind of thing that everyone has to do. But in canoe, there's, there's just not a pattern. It's just whatever works for that person. Well, that's the... It's bringed almost the end of the broadcast here I hope you've enjoyed it I hope you've seen some great racing got the big one left now K for 500 metres for the men 
és akkor azt szeretném kérni mindenkitől a kisra, hogy mennyire hangos állapotok várnak magyarok! Szerinti így, here we go, official dance. Mark the fuck so. Tarnowski and Thomas Seymour, 1, 2, 3, 1, 43.